Right, so we are back with The Walking Dead now. Where we left off from the previous episode, we were walking around the pharmacy. Uh, we're trying to look for some stuff, get some natural condition pills for the old guy. Um, Glenn went down to the motor inn to find some gas. But he got a little bit of a pickle, so me, well, Lee and Carly went down to the motor inn to try and get some to try and help him out. Then told us that there was a girl trapped in a room, which really annoyed Carly and pretty much annoyed me, which was uh, was yeah annoying. But they didn't give the option of whether to stay and help or whether to just go back to the pharmacy and just leave the girl there. Unfortunately, we have to now go help her, so we've got to do some stuff. Let's pick up the wall. Back. Pillows. That could come in handy. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. That might work though, to be fair. So I found here. Uh, uh I really need to try and find a weapon of some sort. I saw one working on the other side of that car. Well, over here. Let's go to the truck. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Oh, look then. Screwdriver. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. How? I don't want to break it because that would definitely cause noise. Could try the pillow. I'm on burn. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Uh, let's get back now. Just done that. Why is that the same one? We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. Uh... Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Smother. Good. That was sick. Now oh, shut up. <laughs> I like how those two just looked around like, meh. Alright, let's have a look in here. No, I don't want to push it. Are we open a car? What's that? What can we find in here? A spark plug. Oh, I'm not gonna get you. It's a spark plug. Spark plug. Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Could come in handy. Actually, I want to get that um, screwdriver first before I do anything else. Picking a truck? Are you, are you sure about that? What's that? Wait. Let 
me see the spark plug. Okay. Porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Hmm. Okay, we can do that. Yeah. Uh. These zombies are bloody ugly, aren't they? Let's get that screwdriver. Oh, oh. It's a screwdriver! That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Right. Now where do we go? Do we go to the car or do we go back? I don't know, what do we do? What do we do? Car. I really want to stroke scramble a zombie's brain. Uh, just push it. That was awesome! <laughs> Zombie friend's still not interested. Get back over to the brick wall. I want to get. We go over to the truck. Without him no soon. Oh, for goodness sake, that one can never think about. Scramble the brain. I'll wait for him to get closer. Why not in the brain? Quick, quick, quick! Oh, shit! Okay then, so that happened. Try again. <laughs> Dead son. We did him. Don't get him! Nice! Thanks for having my bag. For sure. <laughs> That's what I... We kill this guy? Oh, why not? Grim! But cool! <laughs> Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice pick sized hole. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Yeah, hold on, calm down. Let's grab the axe. That'll come in handy very Two nicely. More. That should help. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's go. Let's get up there. Sneak our way up there. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Why not? I'm gonna kill those motherfuckers. Oh, what we got, what we got. Round in. Take it easy, take it easy, take it easy. Come on, where's the option to kill them? Kill these fools. Madness! How mad was that? Oh, dude, you are insane. Alright, so I take it we just... Open the door? Hello in there! We're here to help! Please just go away! 
Let's go, guys. In a minute. Oh, come on. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in... No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Yeah, see? Yeah, see? Okay, that's that done. Oh, damn it! Stop! Just stop! I'm coming out. Oh, she infected, bro. Oh God! I, I said, stay away. We need to get you help. It's no, too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away! I'm bit! You did say but you were bit though. Leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I no. won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? What? Oh, for fuck's sake, I don't want that. Seriously? It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. Uh, we'll go okay, up, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. Time to go home. Gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? I Give can... it to me. I can just, you know, end this and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Well, Give it to her. It. What? Do it. You can't be serious. She, do it. If she no. wants to, if she wants to, look, uh, please, because uh, we can't take. Look at her, Carly. There's no happy ending to this. Okay. Fine. You'll get it back. I promise you that. Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. Go. We can't go yet. What? Why? Why oh, yeah. not? The gun. Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't Don't. leave it. You two go on. We okay. need a gun for survival. Jesus. You sure? Yeah. Oh man, this is intense. I'm here with you. You're a good man. No worries. Poor girl. Poor girl. Wait, where did they get the car? Where did they get the car from? What? In. Yep, yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine, and well, yeah, hmm. we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. What are the keys? Where are the keys? Or maybe we have to go outside and... Shit. We got so we had outside now? Might as well, I think that's the only the last call cool, cool, really. Mr. Doug. How are we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Uh let's it. have a look around. Okay. I can tell that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. Which is probably not a lot. <laughs> I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, Maybe. I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Uh, what can we do? The brick there. Um. Uh... 
That place is full of TVs and electronics. Mm hmm. Try to remote, why not? Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? Mm -hmm. It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. Well, there's lights, so. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's okay. try. Well, well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I've got a few of them to take notice. <laughs> no, no, no. What can but we do? Enough. What can we do? Try to get in there and get weapons. I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Nice. Look, over look at the one trapped over there. Better than oh. us, huh? No. Oh shit. What? Do you know that guy? Shit, that's his brother. Kind of he has a familiar face. That's his brother. Oh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know. And they start rotting and get all chewed up and shut up. Oh dog. shit, that's his brother, no. Oh Lee, bro. Look no. at the uniform though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. Hmm, could have. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. What can we do? I don't Oh, brick. I can't reach that brick. Oh, what do you do? What's the code? What's the code? Tell me the code. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Oh come on! How are we gonna get? How are we gonna know that guy has the keys? Sit over here. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Nope. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Yeah, there's a brig just outside. Come on, can I open it now? Doug, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No, yeah. No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man. What about Glenn? There were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. Oh we're my also god! Party to some egregious fire code violations. We're gonna have to use the axe. That's all we can do. We're gonna have to use the axe to bloody. We could use the remote, but that's not about. Go use the axe. It's gotta be done. Awesome. But now, now we don't have a look. Those things. Carefully. Yeah, can we uh move this slightly? Get the brick. <clears throat> We're not gonna puzzle this. And then we smash, I guess. Good throw.
Now's the time. I gotta get over there. Run! Run! Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Yeah, I don't want those guys coming over here and chomping my head off. Have to do this. Grim. Very, very grim. There we go. Holy crap! Oh shit. Run! Oh what? How did they know? Man, that was close. But Too close. did it. That's all that matters. Right. Oh man, holy. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Thank Let's you. get in there. Thank you. Right. I can get the axe though, that's good. Oh, oh fuck no. you! Shit. We gotta hurry. Come on, get the pills. Oh no! That that one has a, <laughs> a screwdriver in his shoulder. Are we watching this bit? Apart from that, they're all going to the drugstore. Oh, fuck. Doc, come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back! Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly-dallying. I don't either. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. Oh, Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Well, if I'm, I'm coming here, I've got more. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Come on. You can do this. Stay away from the windows. Come on. Go. Go, Doug. Hey, Lee. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. Shut up. Doug, Saying the time. You don't make it through this. You should know. Oh, fuck. Uh. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit. 
Yeah. Get that. Someone. On it. Are you sure? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Rafa, you said as well. Shit. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Go, Clementine. Count on you. Come on. Back room, look in the back room. Get it, go get it. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, come on. Come on. That will do, I don't care. Shit, come on. Right, that's secure. That's shit. Oh no. I'm gonna go with Carly. She's the one with the gun. If we lose her, we've got no weapons. We've got to go Carly. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dog. You're a good guy, but. I'm sorry, dog. I'm really, really sorry about this, buddy. Wait, maybe I can save, save both of them. Nice. Nice. Wait, quick, no! God. Let's go. Shit. Two enter, one need. You gotta move. Keep stomping out of it. Go, Clementine. Go, 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 go. Run. What pillock? What absolute gun? I hope I get the chance to kill him. Oh, Kenny. Oh, Kenny, you are a legend. Especially a good friend. You are a legend, Kenny. And that door is closed. Jesus Christ. That was intense. I don't care, that Larry guy is an absolute dickhead. And if I get a chance to kill him, I'm going to kill him. I will remember this. <laughs> well, we know Douglas perked up. Oh, Leah, come. Oh. Now we're. So we talked to Glenn. Can we do. Hey, Glenn. In all counties, Georgia cities and their current level of disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage 9 catastrophe. Augusta, stage 9 I think I need to go. Why? To Atlanta. Yeah. I got friends Back. there. Here we go. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Mm -hmm. Do what you have to do. Well, she ain't too happy. Sing that show call you. You gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We we'll too, try. bro. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah. Oh, okay. what does that? Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Yeah, I thought he was angry. Anyway, see you around. Good luck, bro. I know you can do it. <laughs> On the back of that pickup, shit happens. 
I'm going to talk to these guys. Hey, kid. I want to talk to Kenny and Thatcher. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yes, yeah, we do. We do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah, what about yeah. Earlier, I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. <laughs> you did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Oh. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. He's a legend. He's an absolute legend. I know that scumbag Larry is. I fucking kill him. Got okay. some supplies though, which is good. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking that's about not, Doug. That's not we couldn't have saved shot. him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Aww. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, <laughs> I'd rather be alone, I think. Okay. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I didn't. I saw you. Yeah. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Mm. Me too, Carly. If yes, I was honest, I was gonna actually go try and help save uh, Doug as well, but fortunately he, uh, yeah. The Jumatron had this minigun on his shoulder. It's yeah. all like pow, pow, pow. I thought you Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then? Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. <laughs> oh. I'm oh, sorry, duck. there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. Mm. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. I thought I was just walkie-talking. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. Oh and no, you should make me cry. It's gone. Maybe we can Don't make me cry, please. Don't I'll just cry, keep please. this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Oh, for sure. Let's go Let away. Go deal with this. I don't want to oh, talk man. to you. Clementine, another thing. Shut up, Doug. <laughs> what do Shut you up. want? You like my daughter? She's fine. She's fine. Fine, huh? Well, just fuck you, Lee Everett. How do you know me? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. And you go near my daughter or step out of line once, and so will everyone else. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Why did I have to find those pills? Hey, I could have just left them. Do you have a second? Oh, I just want. Uh, I want to kill him. I want to kill him. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. Yeah, he should be thankful for that. Fuck, he saved his life. Dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I can't really save everyone. We're lucky to have you. Thank you. Appreciate that. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. <laughs> Me I. too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. That's a Me good too. plan. I we got plan. beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There yeah. are worse places to call home. Oh yeah, yeah definitely. you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. I think so too. Oh shit. Oh shit. That ain't good.
next time on The Walking Dead. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. Oh shit, no. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. Okay. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's yeah. coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Grim. Yeah, because Kenny saved me and I saved his kids by loyalty. No more, please! No more, please! Oh shit, this is going to take. Please! Oh. Grim! Grim, 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 Grim. Oh man, that was intense. Right, honesty, Liza Herschel. You and 63% of players were honest. Who would you save, Duck or Sean? You have forty nine percent of players chose Duck. Why Duck? Wow, I was in a slight minority there. Loyalty side for Kenny. You and forty eight percent of players could defend Kenny. Why? Why only forty eight percent? Why only forty eight percent? I'm sorry, but that's just mad. We saved this kid. I need. Gave us a lift to the drugstore. Unless you gave Irene the gun, you know, 45% of players gave her the gun. Oh, okay. You, so, 55% said no, don't bother. Hmm. Who would you say, Doug or Carly? You and 76% of players chose Carly. Oh. Well, she had the gun, so she was like more useful in a way. Wow! So that is episode one completed. I'll be back for episode two. Uh, maybe tomorrow I can give that a start. And yeah. Yeah. That was an interesting game, that. Very, very interesting game and very enjoyable as well. I enjoy playing this game. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed the Eve's, well, episode one of The Walking Dead. If so, then please do leave a like, subscribe if you're new around here to keep up to date for when I upload. And don't forget to come watch me play this on Twitch, uh, which will be linked in the description below. And I will see you guys next time. Cheers, lads. Peace and bye.